Well, hello. Welcome to Chapter 2 of the Lightspeed Lift Story. In Chapter 1, we talked about why Lightspeed came to be. A body weight support system that was effective at taking off weight, was efficient to put on, and was economical. So I want to show you today how the Lightspeed Lift sets up in, in around any treadmill. As you can see, looking at this, We've got this frame set up around a regular professional grade treadmill, but it will fit around any treadmill. Without any bars on, the treadmill is still totally your treadmill. I can get on the same way. I have access to the front. I can come in off the back. There's no impediment to me getting on and off the treadmill. And yet, and when I want to make this a body weight support system, I simply add on a bar to the front and the back. And that's totally simple to do. And the bars are incredibly strong and effective. Everything is now set as a body weight support system. Five seconds. Next step then would be putting on a belt. <clears throat> the belt was developed to fit right over street clothing so that people can test this out. Uh, we can fit somebody, virtually anybody within this system from someone with a 20 inch waist all the way up to a 72 inch waist if we wanted to. Buckle on the belt, tuck the tail if there is any, slide the straps so that they're straight down the leg, straight down the side, bottom one on first just above the knee, second one toward the top of the thigh, other side Hanging it straight down. First one, the lower strap first, just above the patella. Second one, up the thigh. Now I'm ready to go. I measure down 12 inches to my hip. I chose 12 inches because that gives 25 pounds of lift and clinically over the years that's been an effective amount to use as a starting point. I would always rather have people start with less than more. So once you've got that height set, clip the back in first. Grab the front bar. Pull yourself forward so that you can clip in the front. And now I'm unweighted by 25 pounds I'm going to lessen the impact force of each step by 15%. I'm going to have lateral support. If my body has any kind of vestibular tension or trauma tension or fear tension, taking that weight off and adding support, uh, it's just funny to watch what a difference that makes in people's whole posture, how they just relax. Imagine if you were walking 20 feet up in the air on, a, on a, even a two foot wide beam, how difficult that is compared to walking on the ground. This puts you on the ground. This really feels good. If people are still not quite feeling comfortable, and you, you'll get a pretty quick sense even before you start the treadmill moving, here's how you change it. Unhook, front, unhook the back, Lift the front up, one notch. Lift the back up, one notch. Clip the back. Grab a hold, clip the front. And now I'm lifting up by another seven pounds, which might not seem like a lot. Again, clinically, having worked with hundreds if not thousands of patients over the years, 
I found this to be a tremendous uh, change, just that seven pounds. If more is needed, there are ways of getting even a little bit more. Now I'm ready. Like any normal treadmill, straddle the belt. Put on the safety clip, just in case one does fall. Start that belt, bring it up to a normal walking speed. Get that client comfortable. First off, walking. You have access to handholds. You can hold on the front. You can hold here. Ultimately, what we like to see is people being able to move the arms in a normal walking motion. But then another thing that's so nice about this is I'm not disconnected. There's nothing between me and the floor. There's nothing at all between it's grabbing my chest, causing tension. My arms are free to move about. My head can turn side to side. I've thrown footballs and basketballs at people as they're trying to move about. Even at a slow speed, I can get into a little bit of a jog if I want to. I can do marching maneuvers. Life is lived on all three planes. It's nice to get people relaxed and moving. And the belt has just enough give in it that you get to experience a loss of balance, but not quite lose it. So play with it. I'm going to take this up into a run. Your clients may or may not be that. You yourself, if you're buying this as an individual, might have no desire to run. But many people watching this are going to want to run and get that big light speed smile. Enjoy.